Hey what is up everyone I hope all of you are doing great and in today's question we have the given circuit consists of an ideal battery n identical resistors each of resistance r and n plus 1 identical conducting spheres each of resistance small r assume the balls to be at great distances from each other as well from the circuit of course that means there would be no induced charges between due to the interaction of two consecutive spheres find the total charge finally accumulated on the spheres after the key is closed okay so this is the circuit as you can see so let us go to the solution page so after turning on the switch as this point is grounded so this will be of zero potential if this is zero zero this will be v naught v naught okay now the potential at each points is gradually decreasing so the current that will flow through the whole circuit would be v naught divided by a, as there are n number of resistance connected in series so n r potential at this point that is v1 would be v naught minus the potential drop across this resistance that is i times r that would be n minus 1 by n times v naught similarly v2 will be v1 minus v naught by n okay similarly we will reach till the last point that means this point and this point would be v n minus 1 potential fine so v n minus 1 would look like this fine so the potential at any you consider any point okay let us suppose this point so the potential at this point is v n minus 1 so as this is connected with the conducting sphere by a wire so the potential on the whole surface of the sphere will be v n minus 1 so let the charge here be q n minus 1 so that means k e q n minus 1 by radius of this sphere would be equal to this potential right so if we consider q naught be the charge on the initial on the left most sphere so k e q naught by r equals v naught so q naught is r by k e v naught similarly q1 would be r by k e v1 that would be like this in the form of v naught okay so we we got this in our initial equation so we'll reach till q n just before q n that is q n minus 1 would look something like this now in the question they have asked what they have asked the total charge finally accumulated on all the spheres after the key is closed so the total charge is nothing but the sum of q naught q1 till q n okay so taking r by k e v naught common so we have this series okay so taking n common from the denominator we get n plus n minus 1 till n minus of n minus 1 okay so taking all adding up all the n's we get there are n number of n's okay so it will be n square and taking n minus common so 1 plus till n minus 1 okay so 1 plus 2 plus till n minus 1 would lead you to this one final answer will be this one okay so i hope you all have found this video helpful and informative if you are new to this channel please do subscribe or i will 